So what I'm going to do first is basically come over here, make sure that you have this uh, this thing selected, the pencil. It's basically telling you that you're basically drawing something, mm -hmm. right? So then I'm going to come over here and look for the atom that I want, and I, I'm looking for carbon. So I just make sure that I have carbon, mm -hmm. and I'm going to say add hydrogens automatically, and then I'm just going to click in here. So that is like a methane carbon with four atoms, uh, hydrogens, but I know I don't want that. So I'm going to uh, uh, click on it and then drag to the right, click, drag here, click, drag here, click, drag here, right? Already I have five the five uh, carbon atoms that I was looking for, right? Okay. Um, but what I'm going to do is that I'm now going to add in my oxygen atom. So I have to come back here and then look for oxygen. And then I believe the oxygen is in the middle, right? Mm -hmm. uh, and then there's another oxygen atom here as well, right? But if you look closely in the, the middle, uh, the middle oxygen, right? So what I just did there is basically click on that again because there's a double bond. If you look in that figure in your lab manual in page 63, you see that there's a double bond there, mm -hmm. right? So, so right now, I'm done drawing the structure that I want, right? In my figure okay. here, it's kind of turned upside down. Mm -hmm. um, so let's see. If I want to navigate, I can use this navigate thing and then move it around, right? I can flip it either way that I want, upside down, right? But it kind of looks like this in your, in your lab manual. Uh, but now here, the next thing I have to do is optimize the geometry of the structure. So basically, when I'm optimizing geometry, what I'm trying to do is apply best fit theory to minimize the repulsion as much as possible. So what you have to do is um, you have to come over here to extensions. Mm -hmm. And then under extensions, you have this open uh, uh, babel over here. Mm -hmm. And then if you look closely, you see this thing here saying that optimize geometry. Mm -hmm. Right? So just, yeah. look at, just, keep a, just keep looking at the structure the moment I click optimize geometry and see what happens. Okay. You see like the structure all of a sudden has changed and all the bonds have kind of moved about and just rearranged in a way that it is almost perfectly nice and symmetrical, mm -hmm. right? And by this, now I've basically optimized the geometry for this molecule, right? And, and, then, and that's really how you use the software, right? If you, if you don't want to look at uh, this uh, ball and stick structure, I can come here and then remove it and then add in Vanda walls. Mm -hmm. If I don't like Vanda walls, I can use wireframe. You know, it's mm -hmm. still like the oxygens, hydrogens, and everything. Um, you can use, uh, what is it? Let's see. I can use this uh, licorice type structure, right? It's basically the same thing, whichever way helps you uh, see it better. Because at this point, it's just now about design. Mm 